The moment I decided I wanted to do surgery was when I entered the operating room and saw heart surgery for the first time. It was really thrilling to be able to see the human heart beating and then to be able to put your hand on it and know you can make a difference in this patient's life. My mother is actually a woman in science. When I was very young, uh, she and my dad brought uh, my brother and I to Canada, and she had no money, no English, but she supported us by being a grad student here at University of Toronto, where she completed her master's and her PhD in biophysics. And she balanced her career and her family life effortlessly, and set a great example for me, and was a fabulous role model. During my training, I had the opportunity then to pursue graduate studies and I was able to use my engineering background and apply it to answer some questions in cardiac surgery. And that was when I realized that I also wanted to do research and pursue science because um, that allows you the opportunity to impact patients beyond the ones that you see day to day. My advice for young women who are looking to pursue a career in science is that sometimes they can hear even in 2021 from some people that they would have to choose between a fulfilling career and family life. And I can tell you from personal experience that that's not true. And you can definitely pour your heart and soul into your career and still pursue a family life. I think it's a very exciting time to be a, a woman in science. I think if you're interested in, in pursuing science, it means uh, that you're joining a large co and growing cohort of, of leaders and entrepreneurs and innovators. And so I think right now is actually a fabulous time to be a woman in science. My name is Jennifer Chung. I am a cardiac surgeon here at the Peter Monk Cardiac Center, and I am a scientist.